Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the first ever Dave Reacts. I hope you're having a fantastic day today. Dave K here today with my first ever Dave Reacts video. I'm going to pull up my first ever vlog and watch it and react to it with you here today. I was scrolling through my channel thinking my first ever vlog would be when we went to Disneyland and checked out the brand new Star Wars Galaxy's Edge at the time. And then I found out and rediscovered that my first ever vlog was my trip to LA. I did a three minute vlog when I drove down to LA back in May of 2019. So it's been a little over two years since I filmed that very first vlog. Prior to that, I was making video game videos on my channel, decided to try something new since I was going to LA anyways to meet some friends, and I decided that I would vlog it and share it with you, and I'm so, so glad I did. You all absolutely loved that video. It did really well and turned over a new leaf of vlogging on my channel. I've always had a dream to entertain, to be able to be in movies or do stand-up comedy or do public speaking or some other way of motivating and inspiring you. So when that vlogging worked out for me, I decided, let's embrace it. We're gonna vlog some more. And since then, I've continued to vlog. The video game adventures have dropped down to just about zero, but still love and sharing adventures with you, whatever they may be, challenges, music videos, parodies, and so much more. Today, let's react to that first ever vlog that started it all. I remember this video being mostly pans and music. It didn't have too much of me talking. Instead, me showing you the visuals as I drove from the Bay Area down to LA all along the way and checking out some of those nice shopping centers in LA that I really enjoyed, like the Grove Shopping Center. Scrolling through my channel as well, I see the Twitch Sings videos were doing pretty well at the time. I did a few tutorials of some of the other games that I played, which did pretty well. But that first vlog really started it all. Without further ado, let's take a look. Ooh, I clicked in and I was already part way through the video. I forgot about those pictures that didn't quite fit the frame. I think I've still had a few of those since then, but uh, I guess we'll see how many of those are in the video. Also appreciating how many likes that video got. 212 likes since then, two years ago. And 97 comments, I like it. Let's take a look. Hey everybody, how's it going? Early on our journey here. <laughs> Listening to my much higher pitched voice Reservoir at the time was not that I was using to start off the video. Really nice place. But you can see I return to more of a normal voice once we get part of the way in, so maybe I was trying to be particularly emphatic or excited for my first ever vlog. Seemed like a couple second intro and then we launch right into the pictures and the panning. Let's take a look. Oh yeah. I remember there were some great visuals on this trip. It was funny how I started this one without much of an intro piece, but I can appreciate the nice video effects that I was able to capture. <laughs> and then the pictures along the way. Oh, I think I actually had my Scion at this time. I think this was my car. So I decided to stop for a burger and I found this really cool town. Oh yes, stumbled across this town with some really cool looking shops along the way. Bravo land. That's right. Huh. All right, everybody, got myself some dinner here. I've got a double double and a shake from In and Out. Hmm. <laughs> it was a messy burger. All right, the burger was great. With a nice crisp edge on the bun. And I've got a Neapolitan shake here, which is a little thick. And I'm gonna take it on the road. Okay, take. I remember that drive was a lot longer than I thought it was gonna be. Driving all the way from the Bay to LA with some traffic as I was nearing LA, so you can tell it was quite dark out as I was arriving. I still had another hour or so to go after that stop as well. I stopped for that burger as well as some gas in the car. I figured, why not share that town with you? But as you know, it can be tricky to share stuff along the way, especially since at the time I didn't have the GoPro or the car mount for the GoPro, which I was able to use, for example, for that Dallas animal feeding adventure. So. Overall, seems like I had a lot of fun for an initial vlog, sharing those small pieces with you along the way. Of course, explains part of the reason why it was such a short video, but still a fun one. See the sights in LA? We're here at the Grove. Oh yeah, it was a little bit tricky to hear me in the Grove there. Of course, I didn't have the microphone attachment at the time either, but huh, really love the idea of just being able to take you fun places that I'm going, pick up the camera and show you what I'm looking at along the way taking us back to the beginning of vlogging and just sharing my fun adventures as I go. It was a great time. Oh yeah. Cookie chefs. 
Oh yeah. I remember checking out a lot of those shops while I was there at the Grove. Lots of delicious looking snacks. Loved those cookie shots. Those looked really good. Figured I'd share those pictures with you, but it's funny how I mix the pictures and the video together on this one. Maybe I was just looking for a little bit more content since I filmed so little, but I'm glad I captured something and shared it. Oh yeah, those snacks looked really good. Would totally eat all those right now. I guess I should eat more before I film these next time. Ooh, oh yeah, that shop. I forgot about that little shop with all that beef sitting out there. You've got like the, the shop where you can buy all those fresh foods, dessert items, but they also had meals. You could get barbecue and so much more in that little outdoor shopping space. I totally forgot about that in LA. It's been so long since I've been, but cool stuff. I use some good music too. I think I like it. The pies. They had some really good looking desserts at this thing. It, it looks really great. I don't think those apples were actually apples either. I think they were caramel covered apples or something. Oh, the empanadas. Okay, we're those look good too. Shazam. Oh, Check Shazam. Out that's so funny. Back when Shazam came out, you heard me mention, was thinking about seeing Shazam. And I'm sure I did. Okay, after a great movie, we're calling it a night. Ah, <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah, I was thinking about seeing Shazam, and I'm sure I did either that night or a different night, not long after. It was a good movie. I liked it. But, ah, oh, nice to share that short adventure with you. I'm not sure if this one takes us to another day after this scene, or this might be the end of it. I feel like it is. It was just the Grove and the trip down. That was pretty much it, but uh, awesome. Awesome to share something. My very first adventure with you. Wow, I'm really glad I did. Really glad I took the time to share something. And the water, oh, I love the water spraying up. That visual effect, I figured that had to be great to share for the vlog, like the water show. That's pretty much what this whole vlog was about, it seems like. Oh, loved it. Thanks for watching. Yes, loved that. Oh, got the food pics in there. Be sure to subscribe. Hugo's Tacos. Love that one. That was always good in LA. Leave comments below. Before I had that formal intro or outro, just put those notes right there on the pictures. I think I actually took those pictures, added the text on them, and then imported them into the video because I couldn't even figure out at the time on my editing software how to add text within the video frame. It was so, so funny. So I generated those pictures separately and then plugged them in with that text. That text looks familiar. Looks like the text that I use for my thumbnails. So I'm thinking that's what I did is I edited the photos, added the text on there, and then plugged it right there in the video. So, so awesome that I just picked up a camera and started vlogging. At the time, I think I had maybe one of those handheld cell phone carriers, something like this, where I can hold the cell phone right on it and just film as I go, and just my cell phone. And I filmed right from there. And again, it was a short one. <laughs> I probably could have covered more. I did give you the insights that I saw Shazam, went to the Grove, drove down on that mountainous route, which was nice as well, but I'm really, really glad I filmed something, started my adventures of sharing it with you. And who knows, maybe I'll get back towards that sort of filming where it's maybe less of the me talking and showing you more of the visuals, maybe shorter vlogs, just showing you the highlights while I enjoy the adventures and focus on enjoying the adventures more. But I feel like it's pretty easy for me at this point to just be able to carry the camera around while I'm enjoying myself. So we'll see what the future holds. <sighs> Either way, I'm really glad that I took the time to share those adventures with you to get my vlogging journey started. It was funny to hear my higher pitch voice as I was filming the initial scenes and how I went about filming them, capturing those pictures and plugging them in there. But so, so glad again that you all enjoyed that one. So glad I can go back and rewatch it and sharing it with you. And I'm so excited for all the fun to come in the future. By no means do I plan on stopping this entertainment goal. I'm still extremely committed to a dream of being in entertainment. This was a little over two years ago, but the channel goes back almost three years at this point. Maybe we'll do some sort of three year anniversary celebration, rewatching some old videos or reflecting on my time on YouTube. In watching the video back again, I thought it was pretty funny how often I said, okay, before I said whatever I was going to say. There were maybe about four lines in the video where I said something and <laughs> I think I said, okay, before all of them except the intro. So pretty funny how I was still getting comfortable with speaking eloquently in front of the camera, but 
Again, a fantastic way to start off my vlogging adventure. What did you think of this Dave Reacts video? I hope you loved being a part of the adventure with me and looking back on that first vlog ever, my trip to LA. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell to stay informed of future adventures as well. And until next time, play on.